it's me, Jamie, G me from Makeup by Jamie. Welcome back to my channel. You guys have been asking me like crazy for my go-to glam look. So many comments, so many DMs, so many messages on Facebook. Always saying, Jamie, show us your glam routine. I am so sorry it's taking me so long to get this video out for you guys. I am so sorry about the lighting. I am so sorry about the background. I am so sorry about my hair. I am so sorry for being sorry. So if you want to know how I got this glam makeup look, just keep watching. So I've already primed and moisturized my face. So first I'm just going to go in with the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. This is only $60. And we're just going to go ahead and apply that with this $20 piece of foam. Just bounce it. Go ahead and bounce it. Bounce that all over the skin. Oh, this foundation is so good and it's so affordable. Now with the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer, I'm just gonna make like a triangle under the eye. Big triangle. And then get the mustache and then the chin. Cake it right here between the eyebrows and then down the center of the nose. Shouldn't you be looking into the camera lens? Oh no no, I just look at myself. I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead. Next up, we're gonna take our Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. Can you see it? Just always have to make sure my hand is behind the product. And we're just gonna go ahead and push that into the skin. It's just powder your entire face, forehead to chin. Doesn't matter what your like skin texture is, whether it's dry, super dry, crazy dry, you still need to powder your whole face. <gasps> Oops, I forgot to prep my lips with my EOS lip balm. <laughs> Allison, so that's been making her look trashy. Whatever, it's fine. So now for the under eye, we're gonna really brighten the under eye and really make it pop. I can't decide between Kat Von D and Mac Pro Emphasize. I think I'm gonna go with Mac Pro Emphasize. It's like a tried and true ride or die staple for me. We're gonna look, oops, this is what it looks like. We're just gonna load it up on our beauty blender and just press it on top of the concealer and the other powder. Just really wanna brighten this area, like white. Okay, mustache area, you really wanna highlight like your boogers and mustache. I think I'm about to hit pan. By the way, I got this at Hot Look. It's just really slenderize the nose. And I actually don't think that's bright enough, so I'm gonna use some Kat Von D and just layer a third layer of powder under the eye. So now that we're looking super dry and creepy, um, we're gonna contour. Now we're gonna bronze our cheeks. This is NARS Laguna. Sucking your cheek like that in the hollows of the cheekbones. And then we're gonna get it on the sides of the forehead, like to slenderize it. Just kind of pull your ooh, hair back really tight. Just bronze the forehead. Not a contour on top of the bronzer. We're gonna go in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Palette. And we're gonna go ahead and go ahead with this shade right here. And then we're gonna go ahead and go ahead. And this is a good contour palette. Just like sink in the cheekbones. So a lot of you guys have been asking me how I contour my nose and get it so skinny like a toothpick. So I'm gonna show you. So I'm just gonna pick, oops. I accidentally dipped it into the banana powder. <laughs> Such a dork. <laughs> so using this shade right here from the palette, we are gonna go in and go ahead and dip it into the contour shade and tap off the excess. So we're gonna take our MAC 217, paint that contour shade along the side of the nose. So now because we have a harsh line, we're just gonna go ahead and flick it down. And then we're gonna take our Kat Von D powder from earlier and we're just gonna stamp that along the sides of the nose to really slenderize it. You see that, you guys? <laughs> Kim K who? So I'm gonna let this powder sit under my eye for a while. I wish there was a term for it. We're gonna go ahead and move on to blush. Today we're gonna use NARS 
NARS is my all-time favorite. It's so relevant. I'm gonna go over with the 16th layer of powder. For cheekbone highlighter today, I'm gonna go in with Becca Cosmetics in Men's Chan. I just basically want it to be so bright that it like blinds people when you pass by. And we want a really like shimmery mustache area and a really shiny chin so that we look nice and oily down here. And then for my favorite part, nose highlight. Just using my finger here, I'm going to go ahead and highlight the very tip of the nose. Just kind of want like a white dot on the end of it. And then using a little precision brush, we're just gonna highlight right down the center of the nose to really slenderize it. So now we can dust off all the excess powder. Go ahead and just go ahead and dust it. And then you're just gonna go ahead. Now we're gonna take the MAC Painterly Paint Pot, which I'm definitely holding right now. Just gonna dab it all over the lid. And this does not crease at all. Now we're gonna set our entire eyelid lid with powder just make them really really dry. I'm such a goof. I can't decide between palettes today so I think I'm gonna use both. My Urban Decay Naked 2 and the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette. Here's what the chocolate bar palette looks like. I'm gonna pick up this color right here. We're just gonna sweep that into the crease windshield wiper motion. It's gonna be our transition color. This palette was also from Hot Look. Now I'm gonna take this poop brown shade and we're gonna go ahead and place that. So now we're gonna do a cut crease. So take your concealer on your concealer brush. This is the one that came in the Naked palette. And you're just gonna kinda create a new crease and then just kinda tap it. So now from the Naked palette, I'm going to shove my gigantic brush into one of these skinny little pans. Oh, these are so pigmented. Just gonna go in here with the color Verve. Verve. We're just gonna pack that all over where we put that concealer. And then you're gonna go ahead and highlight the inner corner of the eye. Just like a stark white blob. This just makes you look very fresh and very awake. Now taking my Kat Von D eyeliner in Trooper. This is what it looks like. Kat Von D is so unproblematic. I'm just gonna create a very thin line. Okay, now we're gonna do my favorite part, which is brows. Brows on fleek. First, you're gonna go ahead and spoolie them. And we're gonna use the color Toop because if you have blonde hair, you want gray eyebrows to keep it out. So you're gonna go ahead and take your angled brow brush and just create an entire new brow shape. You want like a ombre brow. Just look at the difference in my brows. And we're not even done. You really want the pomade to like crust down your eyebrow hairs. So now you're gonna go ahead and take your concealer brush and we're just gonna carve out this shape of our brows. Just really want it to look harsh. Repeat the same process on top. Now we're just gonna tap it out with our $80 sponge. Thank you. And now to create like an ombre brow, we're gonna spoolie the front for just like seven minutes. Now you're gonna go ahead and take your pinkies. And we're just gonna tap the front of the brow to give it like a nice feed. I'm gonna take MAC lip liner in the color Whirl. And you wanna really overdraw the lip. So on fleek. Now I'm gonna go in with the MAC lipstick in the shade Velvet Tare. And you're just gonna do this with your face. Next, I'm gonna assume all of you know how to apply false lashes, and I'm gonna do them off camera and be right back. Last but not least, I'm gonna add a lip gloss. This is NARS Turkish Delight. As you can see, I'm just gonna like slather it on. It's like really, really wet and glossy. So that is it for this look today, guys. Thank you for watching. Oh my As gosh, always Jamie, have you seen Twitter? What? People are hating you. What? They're saying they can't trust you anymore. Why? It's because you recommended live crime to them. Oh my god. What do I do? Um. You know, live crime had a security breach and people are worried they've got their identity stolen all because of you. Oh god. Three days later. Is it recording? I am so sorry, you guys. You like don't understand. I didn't know that. Like, look at me. I'm a mess. I don't know.
<laughs> this happened because when I was six years old, I lost my goldfish, Priscilla. And like, I never really healed from that. Hey, look at me. I have a messy bun. Like, it's not okay. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. It's just been so hard. Like, you guys don't understand. You don't understand. In fact, like, it's your fault, actually. Like, I am the victim. And, like, being an influencer, heavy as the crown, you know? Like, do you guys follow Makeup by Bicol? I met Bicol at our all expenses speed trip to Dubai, and Bicol was so mean to me. Like, she said I had a mustache, and, like, I do, but that's not the point. Like, I have been treated so horribly. Anyway, what I'm trying to say is that I want to do better for you guys, and I just. I promise. Hey, Jimmy. Yeah? Our private jet's waiting outside for us. Oh, okay. I'll be right there. <laughs> I think that's a wrap. Get this off of my face. You could bite the lipstick. People used to do that. <laughs> Remind me to tap my brush like crazy with the eyeshadow. Oh, wow, you really, oh, thank you. I look extra pretty now. You gonna put some more on Adler? Daddy? Yes. Oh no. I meant to uh, put on self tanner and have a really tan body but a white face. Today we're gonna do some eating some kitty. Try it. On your marks, get right, set. Two, Remy, go. make sure you're in the go. show. Go! He <laughs> immediately took it out. Can dad do it without making a face? Oh! <laughs> oh my god. Is he puking? <laughs> it's Black Friday now. <laughs> it is Black Friday soon. By the way, I got the set Holt look. <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny to me. Got a contour. We're gonna use my Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. That was too much. Yes. Don't show that. It doesn't say the right thing. Oh, smarty pants. This contour palette is freaking amazing. Really? Amazing. This is from Amazon. It was a knockoff. Elizabeth Mott. M-O-T-T. -T. Mm. I actually kind of wish my voice sounded like this. It's so much girlier. Why do I kind of like this look? Something wrong with it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's fine. Well, I got it. Let me get up. It's right here. You've gotten up 80 times. Uh, How's it going? Said, Good. You like my nose? <laughs> yeah, you got like a very, uh, what are you going for? 2014 Mika. A 2014 version of you? Yeah, of Jeannie. Mika by Jeannie. <laughs> she do that. Hey guys, it's Jeannie. <laughs> Let's play, Mickey. Look cute. Hey, babe. Will you be in my video? No. I just need your